Hi, Taurus. This is a peek at your partner for the week of September the 18th through September the 24th, 2022. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Taurus for September the 18th through September the 24th, 2022. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Taurus for September the 18th through September the 24th, 2022. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see. For the partner of the star sign of Taurus for September the 18th through September the 24th, 2022. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. So, Taurus. Taurus, this is a peek at your partner. So, Taurus, your partner has the Ace of Swords. Your partner has the Lovers. Your partner has the Devil. Your partner has the Six of Cups. And your partner has the Eight of Swords. So, Taurus. Your partner has the Ace of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory, but this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. So, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that you guys are having this communication. Your partner could tell me that they've come into some truth and clarity. Your partner could tell me that they're making a decision or using this sword to sever. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Ace of Swords for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner saying with, without, or in spite of anyone. I alone, in my own right, am abundant, self-sufficient, independent, and single. I'm single. So Taurus, listen, your partner can tell me that they're independently abundant on their own or they're single. You know, Taurus, listen, you know, you guys could be having a conversation that your partner's trying to figure out whether or not they want to be single or not or questions their singlehood. Your partner could tell me that they've come into some type of truth and clarity and this is the reason why they want to be single. Your partner could tell me that they're making a decision to become single here or a decision concerning their coins, okay? Or your partner's using a sword to sever and becoming single. Taurus, your partner has the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini, but the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with a Gemini, but your partner could tell me that you guys have a strong twin flame magnetic pull. Yes. Your partner could tell me there's another other lover. However, the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Clarify the lovers. For Taurus's partner, clarify the lovers. For Taurus's partner, clarify the lovers. For Taurus's partner, it is clarified with the Page of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is immature, premature communication. But this is also your partner spying, researching, investigating, looking into someone, looking into someone's social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, riding past someone's home, riding past someone's job, asking a friend of a friend of a friend. This is your partner doing their due diligence to gather information and research, looking into something. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that there was some immature, premature communication had here, yes, or they went looking and spying. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify the page of swords. Clarify the page of swords for Taurus's partner. Clarify 
Clarify the Page of Swords for Taurus' partner. Clarify the Page of Swords for Taurus' partner. <clears throat> it is clarified with the Eight of Swords twice. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner feeling stuck. Like they're in a self-imposed prison of their thoughts. This is your partner feeling like they can't move, but they can move because it's all mental. This is them refusing to see some things, refusing to acknowledge some things, a lack of information, block communication. This is your partner feeling stuck, trapped, and blocked. So Taurus, listen, your partner can tell me that they're feeling stuck in a situation here, yes? Or they're blocking communication. Now, Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're feeling stuck in a situation dealing with some type of partnership with work or business. Maybe they had some type of preliminary conversation and they have to make a decision concerning their coins. However, your partner could tell me that, you know, we had this immature, premature communication because someone went looking and spying here and may have discovered that there was another other lover. And this is the reason for the block communication here. Taurus, your partner has the devil. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, but this devil energy can speak of a toxic energy that is looming over you guys' relationship. And what makes it toxic is this restrictive and binding. Someone may be obsessive, possessive, controlling, abusive. Someone may have an addiction to sex, drugs, drinking, smoking, working too much, money, attention, gambling, sports, video games, eating too much, anything that a person does too much of. Or someone here is in a full-blown relationship somewhere else causing this toxic energy to loom over you guys' relationship. So Taurus, listen, could be dealing with a Capricorn, but when we're dealing with this devil energy, this can speak of something being toxic, restrictive, and binding. This can speak of a legal binding contract, but also temptation. Clarify the devil for Taurus's partner. Clarify the devil for Taurus's partner. Clarify the devil for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with judgment. Now, judgment could be your partner passing their own final verdict and judgment over you guys' relationship. Judgment could be the final verdict and judgment in a legal court case. But judgment is forgiveness and resurrection of the relationship. Second chances. So, Taurus, listen, your partner could be passing their own final verdict and judgment here. Someone could be asking for forgiveness in a second chance. Or we're dealing with something illegal. Clarified judgment for Taurus's partner. Clarify judgment for Taurus' partner. Clarify judgment for Taurus' partner. It is clarified with the tower. The tower is Aries and Scorpio's energy. This is something that your partner doesn't see coming. Something that catches them completely off guard. Something that just rocks the foundation of you guys' relationship. This is a shock and awe moment. A moment of revelation. Now, this can be a shocking shakeup or a breakup. So, Taurus, listen. You know, a shocking surprise. Shocking revelation. Something being revealed or a breakup. Clarify the tower for Taurus's partner. Clarify the tower for Taurus's partner. Clarify the tower for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with temperance. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius, but the universe is cautioning your partner to be patient, to heal, and to remain balanced. That any decision that they make, it needs to be a careful blending of the head and the heart. Now, when we're dealing with temperance, temperance is about healing, harmony, being willing to compromise, but also reconciliation. So Taurus could be dealing with a Sag, but your partner could tell me that, hey, I need to heal individually on my own. Your partner could tell me that they're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out and reconcile. Very well could be some type of compromise and negotiations going on here. Also a need for your partner to be patient. Clarified temperance for Taurus's partner. Clarified temperance for Taurus's partner. Clarified temperance for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Two of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner needing to make a decision, but they're in the dark about some things. Some things they just refuse to see, refuse to acknowledge, a lack of information, block communication. So it's hard for them to make an informed decision in this position. But this is also a card of your partner being closed off, blocked off, not wanting to see, wanting to ignore, wanting to turn a blind eye. So Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're indecisive or they're blocking. Now Taurus, listen, this can be about a legal binding contract, maybe 
with work or business here. It could even be a legal binding contract concerning commitment, okay? And your partner has to make a judgment call. You know, it could very well be a shocking surprise here, okay? And maybe they're just trying to be patient here because they're needing to make a decision. So they just may be indecisive about, like I said, legal binding contract concerning work with these coins or whether or not they want to be single or no longer be single here. However, Taurus, your partner could tell me that something is toxic here. It's been a shocking revelation here. And their judgment is to block things because they need to heal individually on their own. Did they go find something when they went looking and so they're blocking? Did they find that there's another other lover here? Taurus, your partner has the Six of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone from their past. Flashback from the past, full-fledged in the flesh. Someone from their past is back. Now, they can be reminiscing on someone from their past, remembering someone from their past, but something or someone from the past is being revisited. This is twin flame energy. This is reconciliation energy. So listen, Taurus. You very well could be this person from their past. They're having feelings of nostalgia, wanting to reunite. Your partner could tell me that someone from their past is in the picture. Someone from your past is in the picture. Something from the past is being brought back up here. Or this involves children. Clarify the Six of Cups for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Six of Cups for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character, someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go-getter, a take-charge type of energy, someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, your partner could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or your partner's wanting to take action here. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the King of Wands for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Queen of Wands. So listen, very well could be dealing with fire or your partner's wanting to take action here. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Seven of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This is your partner being defensive. They're on the defense. But this can also speak to them being put in a position where they're having to defend themselves against rumors, gossip, and other people's opinions. Now, this can be your partner shunning someone, fighting someone off, setting boundaries with someone. But this is also an accusatory card. So your partner could be being accused of some type of rumors and gossip, and they're giving their defense or excuse here. So Taurus, either your partner's kind of standoff is shunning and setting boundaries with you, or they're being accused and they're trying to explain, give their explanation, excuse, or defense here. You know, Taurus, it's... It seems like your partner's wanting to block, block, block. Are they defensive here? Are they accusing you, Taurus, of having another other lover? You're, you're back dealing with someone from your past, someone you was with a you was a couple with. Are they accusing you? Or are they being accused here? And they're just trying to block it out. Taurus, listen, your partner has the eight of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner feeling stuck. Like they're in a self-imposed prison of their thoughts. This is your partner feeling like they can't move, but they can move because it's all mental. This is them refusing to see some things, refusing to acknowledge some things, a lack of information, block communication. This is your partner feeling stuck, trapped, and blocked. So listen, Taurus, your partner can tell me that they're feeling stuck in a situation or they're blocking, 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 playing football here, blocking, clarify the eight of swords. For Taurus's partner. Clarify the Eight of Swords for Taurus. This is that defense. Clarify the Eight of Swords for Taurus's partner. It is clarified with the Ten of Cups. 
Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is emotional fulfillment. This is the apex card. This is the happy family, happy life, happy wife, happy, stable, committed relationship, and happy home. This is what we're all striving for. So we're speaking of marriage, commitment, home, family, emotional fulfillment. Now listen, Taurus, someone very well may have commitment on the brain here, yes. However, in tarot, tens are ending, so it could be an ending to you guys' commitment, marriage, living together, situation, family dynamics. Taurus, listen, your partner could tell me that they're stuck on this option of going into commitment here. They have to make a decision on whether or not they want to remain single. However, Taurus, your partner could tell me that you guys' commitment, marriage, living together, situation, family dynamics may be coming to an end here. And they're blocking communication here. And is this over there being another other lover in the picture making it toxic here. Taurus, this is a peek at your partner for the week of September the 18th through September the 24th, 2022. You guys give me feedback, subscribe, like, comment, and share, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.